we are stuck by a train. Um, it looks like one of those long trains. And then it just stopped. Why did it stop? I don't know. Why do trains stop? That... This is... Uh, I don't know. This is... Uh, this will not stand. This will not stand for long. But it did... It, this does remind me of... Uh, uh, sometimes you do got just exercise patience for who knows. Oh, it started moving again. Look at that. All right, slowly but surely. If I it, like, if I was walking, I could have probably just ran, like, walked across and ducked under or hopped over. Maybe I don't know. I don't know if I'd do that at this age. But anyway, um, this actually reminds me of a mini story and also a topic. Um, so like you go, you know, you go to Walmart and when you get ready to check out, there's always like, um, there's always like, uh, the person there that's checking the receipts or whatever. Most of the time they check it. Most of the time they don't, they just put the little highlighter mark on there and, and everybody keeps it moving. Um, so I remember one time I was in Walmart and then a lady behind and like the guy was talking to me, he was just bringing up conversation, but whatever. I don't know. I, I guess I have the face of let's talk to him, him for a while because that happens quite a lot at that walmart um but so anyway i was he was talking to me rambling about stuff and another lady with a cart full of stuff kind of came around and walked out and she kind of like had that like scowl on her face um it, it, i know what it was the scowl was all right he even asking for the receipt, but he already doing something else. He better not stop me, blah, blah, blah. And sure enough, he stopped and said, hey, man, I got to see your receipt. And she was just looking like, oh, I don't really like showing the receipt. Y'all doing too much. And then I was like, he he was getting ready to say something. But I was like, man, he's just doing his job. Like, this show, like he's just doing his job. He just don't, you know, it is what it is. And then she ended up showing the receipt. But it's like, I get it. I don't, I don't know. I, I get the inconvenience, um, especially if I'm carrying something heavy and I don't got no cart, then yeah, I don't want to be bothered. But for the most part, um, usually it takes like an extra five seconds out of my day, which I don't mind, uh, wasting five seconds. I wasted a lot more time doing, look, I'm, I'm stuck by a train for, we'll probably be here about five minutes or so. I've been here maybe three minutes already, but this might be a 10 minute uh, wait on a train, but anyway, I've wasted time doing a lot of stuff. But somebody that's just there doing their job, uh, you know, all they're doing is just checking the receipts. It don't, it don't bother me. Now, a lot of people, it does bother them because they be stealing. Uh, but that's a different subject, you know. We we know you be putting stuff up under the cart and then putting stuff that you didn't pay for on top, that you paid for on top of other stuff that you didn't. You got a cart full of stuff, but your receipt's only this long. We we know we see it. We we see it happen. So those people, yeah, you definitely got a right to be upset at somebody checking receipts. Uh, if I'd have ring, if I ring a PlayStation system up as a bag of grapes, I definitely uh, would not want nobody checking my receipt. But I guess some people just feel like it's like a like a discrimination thing, which in some areas they do have that. Um, but then don't be mad at the person. Be mad at like the system. Write a letter to corporate or whatever saying, hey, we think this is unfair. But also, I don't think it's that big of a deal to me, mostly because the people that they put up there, they're usually our elder folk, you know. So what I see it, I see, you know, uh, no, my grandma, or somebody else's grandma, they just they're working. They're usually kind, hard, sweet. They always got some words of wisdom. Um I always got some advice, you know. If you if you walk in out, you don't got a jacket, they'll tell you make sure you put on a jacket. It's cold out. Yeah, you're right. You, a little, little stuff like that. And all they're doing is just doing their job. And all they want to do is put the highlighter mark on your receipt so they can get paid and they can go take care of whatever they got to take care of. Um, sometimes I do think in society we get like very selfish and entitled, where it's like me, me, me. I don't want anybody to inconvenience me or how dare you ask for my receipt and how dare I got to stop for a second and show you blah, blah. I'm not a thief. Like I, we get into that bag so much that we forget like, Hey, you know what it is, what it is. Um, it, it is what it is that, I mean, that does suck, I guess, but you know, misplaced frustration. So take your frustration. There's some nice graffiti on these trains shout outs to whoever be graffiti these trains i don't want y'all get in trouble with them but there's some nice artwork on here it's like, it actually makes the uh watching the train go by not as bad 
because uh, you know you get to see different graffiti and stuff. Um, some people do actually take the work and they're talented. Some people we know you just tagging your gang signs. It looks tacky, and the rest of this artwork is pretty much shitting on your artwork. Uh, I would say it's nice. Nice. Um, some of it I can't read, but the colors are there. They're blending it really nice. Really nice artwork right here. This is, there should be like a parade show where everybody just kind of watch a train, like, you know, show multiple artists or whatever. Like everybody gets to like spray paint a mural or something or whatever they want to do on a train. And then at a certain time, that train will go across the town and people can set up lawn chairs, barbecue. Oh, that, oh, there we go set up a lawn chairs barbecue have some snacks maybe some music playing and you can look at artwork maybe vote on the app whose artwork is better there'll probably be a qr code every so often you can scan download the artist information okay yeah that, all right anyway so show your receipts at walmart um it's not that big of a deal it's not that a hassle if it is a hassle take the hassle up with corporate um, but I would say don't because we don't want people to be out of jobs. Like you know, we don't want we don't want people to be out of jobs. If they if they're willing to work, let them work. It ain't bother you that much to show your receipt, unless you're stealing. Then I get it. But if you're not stealing, it 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 takes five seconds out of your time. Um. So yeah, that's all I got to say about that.